you all right then ladies and gents how is it going we're out on the Tuareg but we're not we're not this is just me filming the intro uh, recently I broke a spoke on this I'm not quite sure exactly when it happened but it was picked up in the uh, annual service I had down at Brighton Moto who are the people I bought the bike from and who I trust to uh, service the bike but anyway they had to order a spoke in for me and uh, I went down and picked it up today and they very kindly said uh, they could either fit it for me or they could talk me through the process on how to do it myself for this video which will help you lot should you break a spoke in uh, uh, replacing any spokes that you have on your Aprilia Touareg 660 due to the uh, spoke tubeless wheels um, yeah it's slightly different than it is on a tube system and a lot easier still fiddly but a lot lot easier and you can do it with the wheels still in place Anyway, um, right, so big thanks to Brighton Moto for one, uh, let me do it in their backyard, two, show me how to do it, and three, for letting me use some of their tools while I was doing it, including their tool crunch. Thank you very much, Brighton Moto, you are flipping awesome. Anyway, right, let's get to the install, shall we? Um, it's going to be a voiceover, just because um, there was some music playing in the background, and also it's a lot easier to do these things um, without talking and just getting it done and thinking about it and stuff like that, and then worry about the words afterwards. So, um, yes, I hope this all comes together in a, a, a format that works, and uh, you've stuck around long enough to actually find out how easy the job is. So anyway, let's go, let's get on with it. Keep that from down. So here you can see the uh, missing spoke. It hadn't actually come out of the bike, it was still in place, it had just snapped up by the hub and uh, that's the uh, location of where the nipple goes. Um, yeah, yeah, so uh, while the spoke was in place I hadn't seen it because it wasn't floating around um, but yeah so the spoke comes with three parts you've got this nipple which goes into the hub and the spoke then screws into that you've then got this little grub screw which screws into the back of that nipple and locks the spoke in place acts like a locking nut and then you've got the spoke now there's several sizes of spokes in the bike so um, yeah you need to make sure you get the right one for the front wheel rather than the ones for the back wheel so just showing you here how it goes together with the spoke screwing down onto the uh, nipple and then once that's screwed in then you put the grub screw in the back and tighten that down in place the first thing we have to do is to fit this little insert into the hub of the wheel and poke it through the hole where the spoke attaches. I'm then going to do a test fit of the spoke, so poke it through the hole in the rim, the lip of the rim, and feed it through down towards where the nipple is in the wheel's hub. Excuse the jaunty camera angle, what I'm doing here is I'm lining the spoke up with the nipple just so that I can screw it in in a straight line without it interfering. And then I wind the spoke by hand just threading it in until I get friction as it tightens up gradually. So test fit complete, now I'm going to remove the spoke and uh, put some copper slip on it and then refit it in the same way that we did earlier for the test fit and once again wind it in by hand until we can't tighten it any further. Now this is something you could do earlier or now uh, we need to remove the brake disc and you can do that by just unloosening all the five bolts I think it is around the rotor and this frees up not just the disc but also the ABS disc allowing you to move that out the way to access the spoke nipple on the inside of the hub and then using a suitable allen key put that into the back of the nipple and gradually tighten it up until you get roughly the same sound from hitting this new spoke as you do from the old ones. Now we want to get this little grub screw and screw it in to the back of the nipple which will lock the nipple and spoke in place, it acts like a, an, um, a locking nut and it also stops mud and horribleness getting in around the back of the spoke 
um, causing problems with the threads and uh, corrosion and all that sort of stuff. Now I struggled a little bit at doing this um, but then Kevin from Brighton Moto came over and gave me a helping hand and uh, yeah he got the thread threaded in literally seconds um, whereas I struggled I just couldn't do it and drop things and all that sort of stuff so uh, yes um, yeah bit of experience helps in this so now the spoke is making the same noises as the other ones it is tightened to the same torsion as they are uh, the next thing to do is to reassemble the ABS disc taking care not to damage it it is very fragile and it will damage and ruin your life um, if you're not careful so be be very mindful of this and uh, yeah then uh, bolt in all the cleaned up uh, disc bolts and use some Loctite and a torque wrench to get them to the correct specs um, I can't remember what torque it was, Kevin set the torque wrench for me um, in accordance with what I pretty wants, I think it was 30 but I don't know whether it was newton meters or foot pounds I couldn't tell you so please do cross reference with the Aprilia service manual if you are doing this to make sure that you one don't over tighten them or two don't under tighten them <laughs> um, I found it a little bit of a struggle getting this disc back in alignment with the hub and the brake disc and the brake disc had also moved a little bit too so when you're doing this just make sure that everything aligns up properly and uh, a tip Kevin gave me was to reverse the thread on the the bolts a quarter turn just so they sink into the hole in the original threads and then wind them on rather than trying to uh, just turn and turn and turn it does help things a lot and uh, yeah they're decent tools and correct methods of using them it makes the world a lot easier a lot easier thanks Kevin for all the tips and help mate Ta. so as you can see that job was not particularly difficult to do there was a couple of fiddly little bits which Kevin showed me through his uh, experience in working in the industry um, the easier ways of doing things uh, so thanks Kevin thanks Brian Mayer. Um so it's all a, a job that you can do yourself if you've got the right tools for it you just got to get yourself a new spoke and uh, have some allen keys and uh, some spanners and what have you. So a piece of cake really, a piece of cake and all basic tools. A bit of thread lock and a torque wrench for um, doing up the bolts for the brake disc again. But yes, yes, that's it really. It doesn't need to be a big long video does it? I put plenty of long videos when I'm out on mega rides and stuff like that. So for little simple jobs like this we don't need a big long one do we eh? Right, well we all kind of all stuck up in traffic. We are in a lovely part of the countryside in Sussex here, um, but it is all a bit rubbish when you've got cars everywhere. And there seems to be an abundance of them today, an abundance. Uh, so we've covered the video, we've covered the topic, we've got the spoke fitted, and now you know how to do it yourselves. All right, well, with the traffic gone, uh, let's go, shall we? So, um, yes, if you haven't done so already, click that subscribe button. If you like the video, give it a big old thumbs up. If you didn't, you can always give it a little thumbs down. I don't mind at all. Um, but please drop in a comment if you've got and a prettier and have had to change a spoke or had one snap um, let me know let me know how you went about getting it sorted and uh, maybe you've come to this video from uh, a different brand motorcycle but that also has a similar front wheel setup or spoke uh, spoke tubeless wheel setup as I've got on here to see how to do this this task it's pretty simple isn't it um, but anyway let me know what way you got if you've got something different and you've had to do the same righty are you right safe take care and I shall catch you all in the next one. Uh, bye bye for now. Keep that one. Promise I'm down. Hey, yeah, you no, know, you gotta keep that bye. Promise I'm down.